my hands was. Let me take you back to the country. Okay. Did you feed it all to the your school or you sold some? Oh no. So my school was actually consuming one meal every term. So if we kill one meal, it could last us to our four months. So we weren't consuming enough. Um I actually sold my cows, but the great thing is we I sold all my cows in two days. Okay. So people about 70 cows people came here the moment i told people i was selling my cows everybody wanted them okay because and that's that's what i that's the advice i want to give to your people watching you anything you do to do the right thing quality yeah. right people knew my car even in this community they'll call it the white people's car okay because they, they said <laughs> oh they all have earrings yeah. hey this one yeah you brought them they were clean yeah right they weren't dirty they don't they are not confined in a place where they sleep in their poop and urine, yeah. right? So everybody knew it. So any serious farmer who was into cattle farming knew that he needed to buy my cow. To go oh, you love to keep his records. Yeah, 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 yeah. Really, I know it was for experiments and something yeah, like yeah, that. Yeah. Did you try calculating, well, maybe I've made profits of this or something like that? Yeah. About selling the cattle? To be honest with you, I haven't done that yet. I, I do have the records. I know how much I sold my cows, um, but I haven't sat down yet to say this is how much I was spending. But I'll give you I'll give you an idea, right? So I give, most of you know the calculation. A cattle give birth once a year. You know, to us it takes us about one year to get that cattle to about maybe 170 kg, and that was the goal. So the feeding is on point. We planted our own feed, so we weren't buying food, right? We weren't going around picking um, cassava fields and so on. We were grazing directly, we were supplementing. Um, medication is the only thing, but you know, cows also don't get sick that yeah, frequently. It's not easy. Yeah, once yeah. you vaccinate them right and deworm them, they're healthy. Yeah. Um, you know, then I had two, two staff taking care of the cows. So, um, yeah, so the expenditure is very low. I think if you can control your mortality rates, right, of your calves and 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 and, and hyphens, then you're good to go. Yeah. So it's very profitable if you want to go into it, but you need to have your source of feed. Okay. That cuts down the cost. When you're able to prevent them from going out, it saves you a lot of headache, yeah. snake bites, people stealing them, infections, all these things, right? Um, so I don't have the numbers for you yet, but I. I would say from my experience, it's profitable. The only reason why I stopped cattle farming is because I like to do big things. Okay. And I knew that I couldn't do cow mm -hmm. at the scale, large scale that I wanted. Yeah. Yeah.